Uh, it is different. Mm. It is quite different. Mm. And yeah, yeah, that's what they do. And um, do we feel comfortable with it? At all? I, I am. Yeah. I am. I, I'm actually started last year. Some guys are to think through because the weather. You know, yeah. weather. Yeah. The weather. Yeah. And um, they come back with F-16s and just you know, step by step, keep using them first as we mm. used our MiGs back, mm. back then. Yeah, so uh, it is really a super fun jet to fly. I'm not saying that a uh, MiG that I flew before is, is super boring, but the F-16 is uh, definitely more agile. We study a lot, we fly a lot, we prep for the missions uh, and uh, so on. Uh, Royal Danish Air Force has taken uh, a huge responsibility on their shoulders for carrying out this mission and um, I can only imagine how hard it is to, for them to train us for day-to-day -day operation, but they are being nothing but supportive. But it, uh, it has been updated several times and, we, and actually, uh, as, it, as it is right here, it's, it's a very, very modern aircraft. It's, uh, it, it's uh, competitive with the, with the best uh, Western fighters. And uh, so, you, so you will, and I'm sure that, yet that the Ukrainian Air Force will benefit from, from that. It's a very modern aircraft that they, that they received from us. So we have a lot of sympathy with the, the Ukrainian people and uh, we want to do whatever we can to help, so uh, of course.